As you already know, the UK left the EU political structures and the European Parliament on January 31st in 2020. And now, a lot of Brexiteers blame the government for not implementing Brexit properly, and others want the UK to join the EU again. The EU, of course, moved forward after the UK left, and so in the next weeks, I will make a test here on the channel by bringing news about the EU in my midday videos, and one of them you see today here. And that will keep people informed what the UK once has left and what people want to return to, to make informed decisions and give it a more fact-based approach. And since my magazine channel is reserved for information on the development of the Russian war of aggression against Ukraine for the time being, it is another reason to do this here. But I, I anyway believe exactly my audience on this channel needs this kind of information. And of course, there is a playlist EU now. And now let's talk about today's topic. The European Commission formally closes the cooperation and verification mechanism, the CVM, for Bulgaria and Romania. The cooperation and verification mechanism had been introduced at the accession of Bulgaria and Romania to the European Union in 2007 as a transitional measure to facilitate progress in the fields of judicial reform and anti-corruption, as well as organized crime for Bulgaria. The Commission has now repealed the two decisions that had established that mechanism. And EU Commission President Ursula von der Leyen said about this, I would like to congratulate Bulgaria and Romania for the significant progress they made since their accession to the EU. The rule of law is one of our fundamental common values as a union and both member states have delivered on important reforms in these past years. Today we recognize these efforts by putting an end to the CVM. Work can now continue under the annual rule of law cycle as for all member states. Since the start of the CVM in 2007, the Commission has regularly reported on progress on the relevant reforms in Bulgaria and Romania. In October 2019, the Commission published its last CVM report on Bulgaria and in November 22, the last one on Romania. For both member states, the Commission concluded that they had satisfactorily met their obligations set out under the CVM at the time of accession to the Union and needed to continue working to implement specific commitments listed in the conclusions of the reports. The work was completed in June 2023 and on July 5th in 2023, the Commission informed both the Council and the European Parliament of its intention to formally close the CVM for Bulgaria and Romania after all the specific commitments listed in the conclusions of the CVM reports had now been implemented. In line with the decision setting up the mechanism, the CVM ends when all the benchmarks are satisfactorily met. The decisions reflect the Commission's conclusion that this is now the case for both member states. The Commission looks forward to continuing cooperation with Bulgaria and Romania under the annual rule of law cycle as for all member states, as I said. And when they joined the EU on January 1st in uh, 2007, Bulgaria and Romania still had progress to make in the fields of judicial reform and anti-corruption, as well as organized crime for Bulgaria. And the Commission set up the CVM as a kind of transitional measure to assist the two countries to remedy these shortcomings. Work under the CVM has been ongoing since 2007 to encourage and follow the reform process based on the benchmarks. As set out in the CVM decisions of 2006, the CVM is brought to an end when all the benchmarks are satisfactorily met. And as I said, in January 2017, the Commission undertook a comprehensive assessment of progress over the 10 years of the mechanism, which gave a clear picture of the significant progress made. And then the Commission set out this number of specific recommendations, which, when met in an irreversible manner by both member states, would suffice to end the CVM process as it did now. And in its October 2019 CVM report, the Commission concluded 
that Bulgaria had fulfilled the remaining CVM recommendations satisfactorily and that Bulgaria had made sufficient progress in meeting its commitments at the time of its accession to the EU and that all benchmarks can be satisfactorily closed. Bulgaria still needed to continue working to implement specific commitment listed in the conclusions of the report, a work that has been completed this year. And since then, Bulgaria is no longer monitored or reported upon under the CVM, and it is monitored as everybody else within the rule of law cycle. And uh, that ends with the Commission's annual rule of law report. And similarly, in in November 22, the the Commission concluded that Romania had made sufficient progress in meeting its commitments at the time of its accession to the EU and that all benchmarks can be satisfactorily closed. Romania still needed to continue working to implement specific commitments listed in the conclusions, but that work has also been fulfilled this year. And after informing the Council and the Parliament in July 23 of its intention to close the CVM, the Commission has now last week adopted two decisions repealing two Commission's decisions, thereby formally closing the CVM. The evolution of the Union's rule of law landscape has given a new context for the Commission's cooperation with Bulgaria and Romania. In particular, The rule of law cycle launched by the Commission in 2019 has provided an ongoing framework with a long-term perspective to accompany sustainable reform with both Bulgaria and Romania as with other member states. As part of that cycle, the Commission's annual rule of law report, which since 22 also includes recommendations to the member states, acts as a preventive tool but also for deepening dialogue and joint awareness of rule of law issues. It also enables the monitoring of the implementation of many of Bulgaria's and Romania's agreed reforms. Their progress has also been monitored where relevant within the framework of the so-called European semester. And if you want to know something about more topics, the next video is right here in the end screen. I'll see you there. I'll be back.